Nick's here again. Um, <clears throat> just want to let you know why it's important to me, ASL. Okay, what's the importance of ASL to me? Well, it helped me in my communication. Communication, awesome. Why? Because I can do this, hey, blah, 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 and I can do this. And this here means I can watch them while they sign. Now, I didn't always have the skill of ASL and language for myself. I grew up in a mainstream program. Um, I'm the only deaf in my entire family, you know, going back generations, okay? Um, being the only deaf person in the family, you know, I have the, you know, two cultures. Uh, I have a hearing culture with my Italian grandma, and then I have a deaf culture, which is I sit alone. My family, they never learned to sign. They didn't, you know, they didn't matter to them. And so, growing up, uh, I was able to take speech classes. Why? Because they wanted me to be able to communicate with them. But they never bothered to communicate with me. Uh, that's the sad, unfortunate truth of the world. I'm not the only deaf person that that happens. There are, there are many out there. Um, it's sad, unfortunately. Parents be more, should be more involved. Um, speech, to get to this level, takes about, I don't know, oh, good five years. <laughs> That's what it took me. From first grade all the way to fifth grade, and I spent in myself in a little cubicle, you know, a little big, no, no much bigger than myself, really. Yeah, small. Oh, me and one other person. At that time, it was pretty big. I was a small little thing. I wasn't as big as I am now. So, you know, five days a week, you know, I had a lunch. You know, like normal people had a lunch and I had recess. And I didn't have a main, I didn't have like a, a real education. I didn't get to go and have class with everyone and, you know, have reading with everyone, math with everyone, because it would make no sense to me. I couldn't hear. So they focused on one thing and that one thing was my voice. Well, my way to speak and I speak well I speak you know well <laughs> um, well that you know for deaf people if you don't know what this means sorry I have to practice this every day I have to talk every day because if I don't talk every day I lose it and my voice is important you know, you can sing, you can not sing. I sing a lot. It may sound awful, but I do sing because I don't hear what I sound like, but I just do it anyways. Be like, ha ha ha, you know, playing ha ha, you know. I make a lot of sound effects, you know, because when I sign to other people, you know, it could be deaf, it'd be children. Children are the best to sign with because they're like, their, their brains are like sponges, you know, and they absorb so much, but if they see like a fire truck go by, they know what it sounds like. They go, ooh, wah, 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 right? That was annoying. Sorry for people with headphones on. Uh -huh. But yeah, you can be like, you know, long, red, long wheel, boom, 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 ladder, you know, driving. Right? Sound effects is important. So I use my voice a lot, and so part of growing up, you know, I feel like, you know, I know a bit of you are young for this, but you know the old movie, uh, Police, uh, Academy, I don't know how to spell it. Again, not a spelling. So I started, you know, we had a lineup, and so we started. I go in to my first class and then they take me and they put me in a speech class. So, yeah, that was fun. That's what they do, basically. I don't know if they do that anymore, but when I was a kid, that's what they did. And then if I didn't hear them, they thought, oh, so I, like I said, I had hearing aids on, right? Uh, I had an FM system and so I had hearing aids on. And it was a little thing that came behind my ears. It went in my ears, but came around, came down my neck. And a little tiny box strapped to your body. And 
They're like a moving radio, basically. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, that was fun. Just growing up like that, going to school, going to speech, going to school, going to speech. Get home. How was school? Hmm. Well, the same as yesterday. I could, I could not say this word to save my life. Okay, you be. <laughs> The word, the word, one word, right, was instrument, instrument, not guitar, instrument, and it can be, you know, music, instrument, that was my word, when I was growing up, my ch and my s, they've never had a sound, I didn't make that sound, I can't hear those sounds, so, yeah, that was difficult, so, uh, graduated with that, went on to middle school. Middle school was a bit awkward because, you know, still didn't have an interpreter. Elementary school, didn't have an interpreter. Uh, put me into a deaf school. That was interesting. That was actually the first time I've seen ASL. Didn't understand a word of it. Um, so they thought it'd be easier to put me in a mainstream with deaf kids. And, you know, they were hard of hearing. But I did this a lot, you know, at the deaf school, they didn't do this a lot because there was no need for it, you know. No need. My middle school was fun. I had a lot of friends. Um, yeah, it was great. High school, even better. You know, people, oh, I'm nervous. No, I was ready for high school. Um, I was that kind of person who would show up like three hours early just to talk with friends, you know. No, no friends ever showed up three hours early. That sucks for me I'm just sitting there. And I was in, you know, freshman, sophomore. I was sophomore year when I started driving. And I drove every day in about 45 minute drive, you know, one way. So that's a total of a uh, hundred. Uh, this is not a math channel either. It's not math. Don't worry about it. <clears throat> this is story time. ASL is important for everyone. Interpreters are important for everyone because Communication uh, sucks, and we value the things we can do with our language. Oh, cat, it's right here. You want to see the cat? Post down below, right here in the comment. Who wants to see the cat? I'm gonna pause it, okay? And hey, look at it. That's a cat. Oh, looky, look, 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 look. Stop it. Stop. Look at the camera. Hey, doofus. Ah, look, look. Oh, hi. Oh, that's a bright light. It's not a bright light. Okay. Yeah, he's not deaf. He can hear. He's a very smart cat, too. Hey, if you like cats, make a comment down here. If you like dogs, comment down below, too. Um, that's going to be my video. ASL is important to me. You know, having that communication it helps um, I want to thank you all you know for watching again if you want uh, you can you know don't forget to like you know click the like click 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 if you click it twice that's cool it doesn't do anything but it's still cool um, don't click this nobody likes this and if, it, if you click this, you know who you are. Um, if that red bo box, red subscribe, go ahead and click that too. And you can see, you know, the next time the video comes up. You can follow me on, you know, Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, 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 the, you know, the blue, white bird. Twitter. Yeah. Thank you so much. Much love. Be happy. Smile.